Interior Cabinet Secretary Dr. Fred Matiangi has directed all regional commissioners and county commissioners to fire all chiefs and their assistants who will be found guilty of abetting illicit alcoholic drinks and substances within their areas of jurisdiction. All man of unscrupulous people around us believe that this is the time to avail cheap liquor, uh, you know, and all that around so that it's easier to campaign because there are, there are people who are willing to spend their money. Some of our county governments are part of the problem. They're not part of the solution. They're part of the problem. Because of the hunger for revenue by county governments. Matiangi said that part of the illicit problem at the grassroots areas is supported by the administrators who at times receive bribes from the sellers. The CS pointed an accusing finger at county governments over the increase of device by licensing sellers without following due processes in pursuit of revenue. You know, licensing of bars and all that kind of thing. There's a new phenomenon. You know, sometimes we are a hypocritical society. You know, people pretend, especially our political class, they pretend that these things don't exist. For the first time, we are seeing now, and you guys know this more than I do, bars and drinking places being licensed in residential areas, behind houses and so on. The fact of the matter is that now people are migrated drinking hours and drinking parties to their homes. He said reports indicated that county governments have been issuing licenses to single houses to operate the business of selling cheap liquor to youth. He announced that a multi-agency intergovernmental team has embarked on an intensive 30-day rapid results initiative to eliminate the rise in illicit brews, substandard and counterfeit alcohol from the market. In the South Rift part of our country, we are chiefs and assistant chiefs in, in some cases, and you know this yourself, are people who actually are meant for rehabs. How, how can you enforce the law? How can you enforce this when you yourself are supposed to be in a rehab? If you are a drunk yourself, I mean, how? You are wobbling to a barasa to tell people not to, to consume illicit alcohol, surely. Compromise is where we ourselves or our officers are complicit to the trade. Interior Cabinet Secretary Dr. Fred Matiangi has put alcoholic chiefs and their assistants on the notice accusing them of being part of the weak link in the fight against illicit brew in the country.